Hey guys, um, I'm doing the contest for, um, the Madhouse server entry, so, uh, I'm doing the Etho Speed Challenge, um, I'm doing Beast Mode, and please excuse me, I am as nervous, because I really, really want to get on the server, it means so much, because... You know, you, you always sit back and watch these other people on, you know, like Minecraft on their servers. Or on the Minecraft server. And you, you know, you watch all that and be like, man, that'd be pretty cool to be on one of those servers like that. Um, just to say you're on a private server is pretty cool. Um, so that's kind of why I wanted to join Madhouse. And I'm just going to go ahead and answer these questions. I'm just going to go ahead and say I don't do very good in this speed contest. Um, the um, Ethos Speed Challenge was to... Um, was to get um, kill as many mobs as you can um, by 30 minutes and if you die you lose and I did end up dying at the night um, so sorry for that and I'm absolutely terrible at recording and editing so this video might be complete crap I don't, I don't know um, um, sorry for that um, so I'm going to go ahead and answer the questions. What uniqueness and skills do you think you can add to the group? Well, um, I'm pretty young, um, 15, so I guess that adds a little uniqueness. Um, I don't know if that'll be weird or anything, but um, I'm not real. I'm not real sure, but I would. I don't know what I'd. I have to think about that answer. Um, I'm definitely not. Ed, beast at building, far from it. Um, most of my builds on anything are small and um, small and little compact, but I try to make it look as good as possible. Um, I, I'd say I'm pretty good at redstone. Um, I'm no Seth Bling or Etho by any chance, but I, I think uh, I can go my way with redstone. Um, so, um, what other games do you enjoy playing? Um, I love the new Prison Architect game that um, was out. It's been out on Steam for a little bit now. Um, I get into it by seeing Generic B play it. Um, it's pretty fun. I like Terraria, but unfortunately, on my new computer, um, Mac doesn't support Terraria. Um, so I always I have to get on my old little crappy laptop to do that, which is kind of disappointing. But I love Terraria. Love Prison Architect. Um, some other games, I love The Sims. Sims is pretty fun. Um, and so yeah, that's about it. I don't really span out. I like any Lord of the Rings games. They're fun too. Um, I made a no commentary AP. Um, and some of the older games, like um, for the old PS1, Spyro and all that. That's kind of my thing. I don't really like most a lot of the new games. Um, what country you live in? I live in the United States of America. Um, if you can tell by my accent, I am in the South. Um, so I'm just going to leave it at that. don't really want to give out anything. Um, what are your three favorite websites? Um, already YouTube. Um, Twitter, because I'm mostly on either YouTube or Twitter when I'm on the computer. And really, that's all I, that spans out, but then I have to say Facebook, because I'm on Facebook quite a bit, too. Um, how, um, how did you first find out about the Madhouse? Really, I found out from Tib, Ray, and Packrat playing Waking Up. Um, I uh, saw it when Packrat first uploaded, I think. I'm pretty sure it was um, Packrat. Um, and then I enjoyed listening to Tib and Ray, so I subscribed to both their channels, and that's how I found out about the Madhouse server. Um, how long have you been watching LPs, and how involved have you been in an LP of someone else's? Um, I've been watching Ethos LP for a while now. Um, ever since he started his map, he's on now, is when I joined Etho. Um, started watching him. Definitely Paul Swords Jr. I've been with Paul Swords Jr. and his Survive and Thrive LP since the beginning of that. Um, how involved have you been in an LP if someone else is not really involved? Like I, I'll comment and like and do all that, but I've, I, if you say that's involved, then um, then that's yeah. <laughs>
Um, do you play games to exercise your mind, relax, or something else? Um, really just for entertainment purposes. Um, I don't really, um, really, um, do that for, um, relax my mind or anything, but if I am frustrated, I'll play a game, which I do attack people. <laughs> Um, if I'm frustrated or something, I'll do, we like, play Hunger Games on Hypixel's server. Just kill people, just relieve some stress, um, but, it doesn't, the, um, just to me, listening to, um, getting on Minecraft, if you're, if you're just something, listen to that C418 music, just calms anyone down. If you listen to it for too long, you'll get depressed, so, yeah, um, what is your favorite genre of movie action? Um, I love action movies, um, that's why whenever one of those, whenever a movie like that comes out, I'm most definitely going to watch it, um, I'm a nerd, so I, <laughs> I go see all the Thor and, um, Spider-Man and stuff like that, um, um, face cam or not, um, I'm not really a fan of face cam, mostly because, um, I, I don't know, I just don't, I'm not real comfortable with the fact that everyone is looking, just seeing me, um, if I ever did LP, I'd rather the channel, if I did commentary, the channel be focused around my voice rather than my face, if that makes any sense, which I hope it does, um, so that's what I was really been aiming for, um, what criteria makes a Minecraft server a good server? I'd say being free to do stuff. Like, this is the point of Minecraft, free for your creativity and um, not being confined to a boundary. You can't, you know, you can't break blocks here or you don't have permission or um, stuff like that. And I like that. You need to, like, my, the point of Minecraft is to be free and creative and um, being able to express yourself in your builds and um, other things that you do. Um, I believe that's really what makes a Minecraft server a good server. Um, also, group activities. Um, if it's just like a little small server, though, like the ultra hardcores, that's what makes a server a good server. Like to show everyone that you're just not there and you know we don't like anybody we're just playing on here for you know just sitting here because we we can and we're bored um, it shows that um, you actually care that you'll set up all these group activities and things um, so yeah and I think that's what makes a Minecraft server a good server so that's all of the questions and before I go any further I'm just gonna let Eric, um, I don't know, guys who are judging this video, that this is going completely unscripted. I'm doing this right off, right off the top of my head, and it is um, post-commentary because I, I, um, let me explain it like this. Um, on Mac, I use the, um, what is it called, the QuickTime player to record um, my screen whenever I do a screen recording, which is very rare. And um, I can use at the same time the um, QuickTime uh, audio recording as well. But the thing is, with the editing device I have, which I use iMovie, it's um, like for some reason I can't like drag the audio over um, into the um, actual playlist. Like it won't let me or something. It's it's very it's very confusing because I'm. I am just terrible <laughs> at editing, and I'm going to try to make this video as good as I can. I'm going to try really hard on it. And, um, but, um, so, going back to the thing, um, I'm doing post-commentary because, um, because of Camtasia. Um, when I try, um, if I record with Camtasia, um, it, Camtasia screen recorder really lags out my, um, computer, um, but the audio recording is a good audio recording. So what I'm doing for this video, I'm recording the screen with the QuickTime player, and I'm recording post-audio with the Camtasia. 
and I hope this good. Um, I don't have a microphone. I'm just using through the Mac. Um, I hope that's all right. Um, from what um, what the Skype calls and stuff, I think um, it sounds pretty good. So um, uh, I might as well go start talking about the video now, making sure I'm on sync and everything. Um, about right now, you're seeing. Uh, I heard a zombie, and I'm trying to dig for it, but I I, I couldn't find him. So I decided it's about nighttime anyway. So what's the point of me just sitting there and waiting for it to appear? So um, it's getting nighttime now. Um, I apologize if this is a little off sync. Um, I'm not real sure how I'm going to um, how I'm going to get all this synced up, but I'll I'll try my best. Um, so I'm start now. I'm going into the caves looking for um, maybe some dark, some actual mobs, um, and find one. So I apologize if it's a little dark right here. I had my brightness on full. Here I see like three, four creepers. Um, Trying to take them out as best I can, but this um, that creeper right there. I tried to back up, but he still blew up because I was stuck in the blocks. And I go after this guy and get him just before he blows up. And then um, I start getting like destroyed by the skeleton right here. Um, so I decided to just eat and heal up and then go after the skeleton like that. Um, as you all know, 1.5 turns skeletons into monsters. So right here, I'm trying to find my way around in this dark because I was stupid enough not to get that, that piece of coal. Um, so I'm heading out. Um, I, I got uh, pigs, chickens, sheep, Squid, skeleton, and creeper. Right now, um, that's my score. And now I'm just looking for other mobs, um, dark dark mobs, um, to kill to add up to my points. I knew uh, at this point I was definitely not going to be able to get to the um, to get to the nether mobs. That would just be impossible because in normal Minecraft it takes me a while to even find diamonds because I have the worst <laughs> luck when it comes to chance and all that kind of stuff. Um, oh, I've also got wolves. Um, forgot about that being like destroyed, almost destroyed by a pack of wolves. So right here I'm much down on my last bit of food. Um, and I see a witch. And this is really a mistake right here because I came at the witch at a bad angle. I came like right under it, like the witch had the upper, upper ground. And it came right towards me and um, when I fight a witch, I always try to go to, like, or, or swerve around it, I guess, um, to get it. So over here, I got the witch and the zombie, and I'm, there's a skeleton behind it. And the skeleton is ultimately what killed me. Um, even It didn't, the skeleton didn't physically kill me, but it was a creeper. But these two skeletons right here, and then the spider, and then, boom. Blow up by creeper. So this is it. Um... I, uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, this has been my entry for Tib Tuners Contest. Thank you.